Hi everyone, have you watched the new Disney movie Wish? I'm convinced Disney is having a laugh. Because what is that? Where's the dress? Where's the transformation? That's it. I'm giving Asha the proper magical transformation she deserves. That's what this video is about. I keep dream, but my dreams keep flying away. A song with fire beyond. Keep chasing them and I never rest for a day. A song I night on two. Looking for a shade when it's hot I've been low-key and I'm trying to stop God, don't feel good Yeah, what's up, what's up? When off I go Pretty afternoon, it's up by store Looking at the skyline Looking back at my life And I gotta say, it's one of a kind Yeah, what's up, what's up? When off I go Pretty afternoon, it's up by store Looking at the skyline Looking back at my life And I gotta say, it's one of a kind Since I ran into you on a street I wonder if you moved Hope everything is going amazing for you And you're not feeling blue I feel the rain poured out my face But that's alright I smile People passing by Some smile back, some might not Why am I always looking for a shade When it's hot, I've been low-key And I'm trying to stop God, don't feel good when off I go Pretty afternoon, it's a best boy Looking at the skyline, looking back at my life And I gotta say, it's one of a kind Yeah, what's up, what's up When off I go Pretty afternoon, it's a best boy Looking at the skyline, looking back at my life And I gotta say, it's one of a kind I
Hi again, what do you think about Wish? I adore the character designs, especially Ashes and Cake Magnificos. And I love, love that Asha ends up as a fairy godmother to the people of Rosas instead of the typical princess love story. Did you notice Asha's fate was foreshadowed early in the movie when she was wearing this cloak? It is the exact same shade as the original fairy godmother's cloak, complete with the pink bow and everything. And the one Star gives her is the exact same design as the one which conjures Cinderella's dress. Since Cinderella's fairy godmother is obviously white and Ashia is a person of color, I think the wand and the cloak are like a fairy godmother uniform, which might mean that the Disney worlds have tons of fairy godmothers out there. Powerful sorceresses just spending their entire lives waiting for pure-hearted people to wish upon a star. I think that's kind of cute. After the ending of Wish, I imagine Ashia moves into the castle and takes over King Magnifico's tower study. She spends all of her time helping the people of Rosas, fulfilling their dreams, sprinkling in a bit of magic here and there whenever needed. Also, I believe Ashi would bring up Magnifico's mirror from the dungeon to remind her never to use her magic the way he did. And it makes me giggle thinking that Magnifico is furious and angrily yells from his mirror whenever Ashi uses her magic to help others. And he's about to get a heart attack every time Valentino jumps around knocking over the priceless artifacts in his former study. <laughs> the dress itself, the one Ashi is wearing, is inspired by old pictures of traditional Moorish clothes from back in the time when the south of Spain was ruled by Arabs, which fits Ashi's heritage perfectly as she is half Spanish and half African. I want to hear what do you imagine happens after the end of the Wish movie? Please comment below. Let's go back to the edit. There we go. This is what I think Asha should have turned into during that weird non transformation in the Wish movie. What do you think? What kind of Disney edit would you like to see next? I hope you have a magical, wonderful day. See you in the next video.